so y'all want to know, do COs or sergeants hook up with inmates while they're in jail or prison from a former inmate? Let's get it. Well, if you want the short answer, the short answer is yes, absolutely. So if you don't want to listen to my story about it, just keep scrolling. If you do, let's get into it. The setting, the location, Texas prison, Gatesville is the town. I was doing a two-year bid, two-year sentence, and there was this sergeant that kept flirting with me. Let's call him Sergeant R. Now, flirting is very, very, very common because these guys know that these women have not had any, in, you know, interactions of that type in uh, months, sometimes years, depending on how long they've been locked up. So they know that they're, you know, thirsty. Um, is it legal for them to be hooking up with these women? No, absolutely not. So Sergeant R was like, every time he'd come through the dorm, he would be like, he'd call out my last name, he would pick on me, and um, I thought it was just like friendly, kind of like, okay, he's picking on me, he might think I'm cute type thing, and then it started getting to the point where he would call me out to clean the pipe chases with him, so every time there were chores to be done by inmates, I was the one that he would pick to come clean with him. And the other girls are looking at me like, why is, why is he calling you every time? I mean, I knew he had a crush on me, but what am I going to do, argue? And that is the problem with COs, sergeants, people that are higher up in prison um, and jails that are flirting or hitting on inmates because we don't want to get in trouble by pissing them off. So he keeps calling me out to clean the pipe chases, to clean his office, all of this stuff. And at first, everything's fine and dandy. It doesn't really escalate at all. But after a couple of weeks, he starts to really hit on me and let, let it be known his feelings. So all the while I'm talking to my cellmate and I'm like getting kind of excited. Mind you, it's been two years since I've had any, you know, I'm like, oh my gosh. So Sergeant R is wanting to do something. I can tell he's talking to me about it now. What do I do, girl? And she was like, go for it. Just go for it. Just be careful because, you know, the girls, the other girls will hate on you. And as much as you want to just go for it, like you can definitely get yourself or especially that officer or sergeant in a lot of trouble. I'm talking felony charges if you get caught. So it's very nerve wracking, but it's also kind of hot because you know you can get caught the whole time. Anyways, I go out with him to clean his office one more time and there's a guard, a female guard that's leaving. It was late at night. And this guard gives me this look of just like, I know what y'all are doing. And it was really scary. But regardless, I go back to the far back office to clean. I grab my mop. I'm not really sure what's going to happen. I know that we've been talking about it for a couple weeks. So I know that this is maybe the time. Well, long story short and keeping it appropriate for this app, he let it know that it was the time and he made his moves. He shot his shot and um, I... We started kissing and we started like caressing and going through first base and second base and we ended up going to third base and mind you this is not something I'm proud of you guys going to third base with a sergeant or a CEO or anyone in prison is not a good thing that prisons are dirty prisons are not a respectable place to hook up with someone please don't come for me this is my story get in the comments let me know your opinion and your questions but I mean come for me if you want but this it, this is what it is this is my story so and it had been two years since I've hooked up with anyone so I am shaking he is shaking because he knows that he could get caught up for this. But we go past first base, we're kissing. We go past second base, which is the other stuff under the clothes. And then we are at third base. And when I tell you that this man did not last even a minute, it was done. It was done. It was like, okay, okay that worth, was that worth the risk? I, mm. It was really, really, really hot. Don't get me wrong. It was this tall, tatted up sergeant, you know, authority of power, you know, position of power type shit. But you know, was it worth the risk looking back? No. And now also looking back, I completely regret it because it's like, not only could he have gotten in so much trouble, I also found out that he was already under investigation for doing this with multiple women or trying to do this with multiple women on different prison units. And it's really sad because 
so this only happened one time I hooked up with him or we did what we did and when I left I went back I told the girls about it or my you know my really close circle about it and that was it I saw him a couple of other times on the unit he wanted to do it again I was like nope I'm about to leave I don't want to get in trouble I'm about to pull chain and get out of this hoe so it didn't happen again I find out that he's in under investigation for doing this with other women and the thing is this is gonna be a whole other story altogether when there's a thing called Priya in prison, and I'll go into this in another story time, that's the Prison Grape Elimination Act. You are not legally able to hook up with anyone in prison or jail because of your authority of power and my lack of authority and the fact that I can get punished or feel like I can get punished because of what I do or do not do with you, um, that's considered grape right so that's very 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 illegal and looking back I'm like well was I you know what did was it consensual in my eyes yes but looking back it's like I also didn't want to displease him or get in trouble for any reason I'd already been through segregation I'd been through going to the mental health unit and all of these terrible places in the prison and jail units so I don't I don't have any regrets, but looking back, it's like I, I feel sorry for the other girls that did go through this, you know? But like I said, long story short, prison inmates do hook up with COs, sergeants, all the time. The guards, all the time. They'll pass notes back and forth. They're called kites. Um, they hook up with, inmates hook up with inmates. Inmates hook up with sergeants. And it can be a major problem in prisons. Have you had experiences with anything like this? Do you guys like stories like this and want to hear more prison story times? Please let me know in the comments. Do I regret it? No. It was fun. Was it worth the risk? Absolutely not because I also found out that he was married with multiple children, which is why I'm not name dropping. And I found all this out later, but it's like, bro, bro, was it really worth the, the possibility of you going to prison for a felony, a grape felony? Oh my God, what is wrong with these dudes? and women. If you don't think that female COs and sergeants also do this to the males and take advantage of how badly the males want it, oh, you are so wrong. We've got to get into so many more topics about this. I'll talk to you guys soon. I hope you liked this story.